Alrighty guys, what's going on? T-Mart here and welcome to a new series here on T-Mart 2. I am very excited about this thing. I've been wanting to do it for a very long time. Welcome to episode one of Mobile Mondays. Yes, that's right. So this series is going to be all dedicated to mobile gaming. Today, as you can see, we're going to be playing some Flappy Bird on my iPhone. And I don't know about you guys, but I do a lot of mobile gaming. Like, I love playing on consoles and PCs and things like that, but oftentimes I'm in places or situations where I don't have access to those. So this magic little box right here is all I've got. Or, you know, my iPad, tablet, whatever it may be. So, so I wanted to start a series around this. You know, I can show you guys some of my favorite games. You guys can leave comments and suggestions for some of your favorite games we can kind of explore some sweet games that we can play on the go when we're away from our you know consoles and computers and things like that so I just I thought this would be pretty cool I figured you guys would enjoy it hopefully you do so today as you can see we're starting off with Flappy Bird this game actually isn't available on the app store anymore the uh, the guy that made it took it down he's from Vietnam so he's like a, a really simple guy like he lives a super simple lifestyle and this app blew up became one of the most popular apps in the world was making like fifty thousand dollars a day in ad revenue or something crazy like that and he said that it was interfering with his personal life he didn't like all the attention he obviously didn't like all the negative feedback because this game is infuriating as you guys are about to see and he just he decided he wanted to take it down. He wanted it out of his life, which I think is pretty crazy. Uh, I would have just you know given the app up and you know donated all the money to uh, to a charity or something like that. But I don't know. It's his call. So uh, I still have the original version. If you've already downloaded it, you'll have it on your phone forever as long as you don't delete it. I've got the original version. I didn't even update it because I haven't played it all that much. I've been saving it for this video. I did play it a little bit just to get used to it. I think my current high score is like a 26 or 25 or something like that, so it's really not that good. I spent like the first five minutes just trying to get past the first pipe, so let's see what we can do here. This is not going to be good, guys. I, I honestly get very, very mad at this game, which is why I, I can't play it and I can't really enjoy it. So here we go. Let's see what we got. Come on, Trev. This game is all about staying cool, calm, and collected, and it's really hard to focus while I'm talking to you guys, but I'm going to try to do both. But so uh, really... The game's not difficult, like it's so simple. As you can see, you tap the screen, your bird goes up, you gotta go through the pipes. I'm sure you guys have played this or at least seen it before. But uh, the, the thing is, is like, it, it's not necessarily difficult, you just, you just gotta like stay collected. You gotta stay focused. You can't get finger happy and trigger happy and you can't just like lose your focus. You gotta stay cool, calm and collected. Oh gosh, this is, this is awful, man. Okay, let's focus here, Chubb. Game face, let's go. You are the man. You're gonna send this bird through like 50 pipes right now. Let me just do it. Okay. I promise, guys, our goal is to beat 26, okay? That's what we're gonna do. That's our goal. If we can beat 26 in this video, that's all I can ask for. So we just gotta stay cool, calm, collected, confident. It's not difficult. It's a simple game, Trev. You just gotta have finger dexterity. You gotta have control over your fingers. Gosh, dude. <laughs> and sometimes, like, the hitboxes on the pipes seem like, whoa. They seem like they're a little bit off. Like, it seems like, you know, you're, you're gonna graze it, but not quite, but you still end up dying, and that's the most infuriating part. So here we go. We're going low. We're going high. Come on. Dive bomb. Nope. Just kidding. Come on, little... All right. I'm telling you guys, freaking play Flappy Bird and <laughs> try to talk to a bunch of people at the same time and be entertaining. It's more difficult than you think. Here we go. You see my game face right now? It's not playing around. Ugh! Okay, come on, Trev. We haven't even, have we broken like 12 yet? Okay, come on. Usually I die in like the 10 to 20 range. That's like, a, it, that's kind of like the, the end of my mental strain ability. Like that's, that's where my, my mind just gives out. And it's like, Trev, why are you doing this to me? Why are you making me this, making me make this stupid little yellow bird fly through a bunch of pipes? This is stupid. All right. Focus, Trev. Pause it. Ah, didn't pause. Okay. Do some stretches. We're going to relax for a sec. Deep breaths. Good thing I'm in a dry fit shirt. Otherwise, I'd be sweating up a storm. Okay, here we go. You good, Trev? You are a world-class fapper. <laughs> I mean, flapper. You're a world-class flapper, not a fapper. Okay, here we go. I guess you could be considered... <laughs> All right, here we go. This I'm serious right now, guys. This is my serious face. We need some Rocky music. Hit it! Oh. All right, guys, here we go. I'm feeling it. We are a much better 
flappy birder than this video has led to believe so far. Like I said, we usually die around that 10 to 20 range. But we aren't even going to stop there this time. I need you guys to give me some encouragement right now. High five your screens. Hit those thumbs up buttons. Let me know you're there for me. Because we're doing this. Oh, we're doing it. What? Sometimes my biggest... <laughs> oh my god, that was really high pitched. Uh, sometimes my biggest problem is the, uh, the distance of the thumb to screen. You gotta keep your thumb close to the screen, but not too close that you like double tap, but you gotta keep it close enough that it's not out of range. Like that last die with the, uh, the crow call after it. I definitely thought my thumb was closer to the screen than it was, and that caused my death. So you, you gotta have a solid thumb to screen ratio. You're the man, Trev. You're the man. Did I just say ma'am? I think I might have. But you're the man. With an N. M-A-N. You are the man? Let's go. You got this. This is the simplest game ever. This is easy. Like I said, you're a world-class flap. Ah! That's all right, bro. Everybody falls. Matters about how you get up. What was that Dwayne Wade commercial? Like, fall, fall seven times, get up eight, something like that? That's you right now, dude. You are the man. You got this. You ate your Wheaties this morning. Or actually, no, they weren't Wheaties, but they were Frosted Mini Wheats. Same thing, right? We got that fiber in us. Oh, yeah. Oh, my God. 19. Why are you doing this to me? All right, listen here, you little bird. You are going to fly above the pipes this time. Never mind. Crouching tiger, hidden lion. Nothing phases me. Mr. Miyagi, wax on, wax off, Kama Sutra, yin yang. I'm literally this close to throwing this through this webcam right here. Just throwing it in your guys' faces. That's how mad I am right now. Come on. All right, we just had to readjust the grip. That was the problem. We were, uh, we were losing the phone a bit. Hands are on like sweat mode times 10. They're seriously so sweaty. This is embarrassing. I'm getting so sweaty playing a video game right now. And it's not even like a super intense video game. It's freaking Flappy Bird. But uh, yeah, we're good now. We got um, some pinky reinforcement underneath the uh, the undercarriage here. So we're good to go. This is the This is the run. This is the run. My eyes get all hazy when we get this far. 19. Oh my gosh. I was just going to say 19. If you stop me again, I'm going to kill you. Okay, here we go. Final time. Time to nut up or shut up. We got it. This dude's gonna fly home for the winter. He's gonna get home. He's gonna hibernate, make himself a nice nest. Reunite with his family. Oh yeah. He's going home, guys. We have successfully delivered him a- No! I wanted to keep going! No, I wanted to break 30! That's all I wanted! Oh! Man, I'm gonna have a brain aneurysm from this. I can't even talk. This just turns your brain to mush. There's so much concentration that goes into this one little game. It's the most ridiculous thing in the world. Okay, well, hopefully you guys enjoyed. Let's, um, I don't know. <laughs> Let's have you guys, if you played this game, leave your, uh, your high scores down in the comments. And don't lie. I know it's easy to lie out here on the internet, so don't lie. Try to be honest. Again, like I said, I haven't played this game much, but I'm just not good at it. And it just, it pisses me off so much. So, I'm going to call that it. We beat our high score. We got to 29 right here for you guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, leave comments down below also for other games you'd like to play. You know, this is a cool game to start off with just because it's like a, an, an app dinosaur now. It's extinct. But, uh, but more, you know, I, I feel like, you know, in the future games will be better because there will be a little bit deeper. There'll be a little bit more to get into than just me sitting here raging about flying a little yellow bird through some Mario pipes. So, anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. Leave comments with your highest score in Flappy Bird if you have one, as well as what game you would like to see uh, on the, you know, a future episode. It may not be the next one, but in a future episode, leave some of your favorite mobile games. 
Thank you guys for watching. I'll catch you guys later. Peace out.